Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Eker, and today in this video I'm going to be showing you guys a super easy way to include game chat no matter what game you guys do play on. Uh, so that way you guys can be recording and live streaming with game chat enabled, whether if you guys have a wireless mic or if you guys do not have an Elgato or Razer or whatever you use to capture your gameplay with uh, and you don't have that chat link cable in order to do with it. So this is going to be super easy steps on how to do it. And the game that I'm going to be testing it out with is going to be Call of Duty, as that's mainly what I play. But I it, it works for an essence for every game. Um, and I'll kind of walk you guys through it and how to do it. So first things first, if you guys are playing on Xbox, uh, you're going to want to make your way over to your account, head to settings. And guys, once you do get to settings, go to volume and audio output. It's going to be located in your general settings. Go ahead and click on that. Make sure you have your headset format obviously on and then head over to additional options. And when you guys do get to additional options, make sure you have headset and speaker set. So that way you can still hear, you're going to hear a little bit of an echo, kind of just play with it. You know, if you guys do have the chat link uh, for the original mic, like if you're using a mic, you can turn it up and down to where you don't have to worry about an echo. Uh, I noticed when I got wireless headset and I did put on headset and speakers, I don't have an echo anymore. But I know originally when I did have wired, it was a little weird, uh, but just kind of mess around with the chat mixer and stuff like that and get it to work. Well, then if I were to go ahead and go into Call of Duty, um, I already have this all set up, obviously, for you guys. So that way you guys can see. Uh, go ahead and make your way over to settings, no matter what game you're on. Go ahead and head over to the audio section, or uh, I'm pretty sure it's volume or anything on any other game if it doesn't have a quote-unquote audio section. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and make our way over to audio. So LT, obviously, I'm in the audio settings. Uh, we're going to go ahead and make our way, and you'll see something recorded like this at the start of it. Uh, this stuff does not matter. This is your personal preference of whatever you play on, like for Call of Duty, for instance. Uh, voice chat is going to be up to you, so this is where it's going to get a little bit uh, tricky. So if you're on Call of Duty like I am, my voice chat is on. My game channel is all channels. Um, if you guys are streaming and, you know, you play SMB or you play some games where, you know, where, where people can get creative with the words they say is what I should say, um, it, can, it can bite you in the butt. But if you guys don't really care too much about it, um, you can leave all this on and just set to all lobby and stuff like that. I just like to mute everybody right away and then just unmute them as the as the stream goes on or as the video goes on or if we win or if I hit a six snipe or something like that. But the, the main thing you guys are going to do is change your voice chat output device from headset to speakers. So if you're on any game and you have it set to headset automatically, go ahead and change it to headset and speakers. Or if you have an option for just speakers, like mine is just headset or speakers, I had to change mine to speakers. And then you're going to want to make your open mic sensitivity to 70, uh, just so that way your microphone picks it up or you can turn it up. This is all personal preference to you guys. And then mute yourself. You know, you can do that, obviously, for playing the game. But the, the best way to test it is, obviously, I'm going to sit here and Call of Duty has a test microphone option. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and turn it on. And you guys will hear not only you're going to hear me talk through my streaming mic, but you're also going to hear me talk in the back of the recording that I'm making of me testing my mic through game chat. So if we go ahead and turn it on like this, you can see that I can speak into my microphone now. So if I turn my mic down from my Xbox like this, I go ahead and see, go ahead and see that I am, I am recording, recording and, I have and I have this going on in the, background. the background. So I am talking so kind of slow, but if I talked slow, fast, I talk you know, fast, you'd, hear it you know, you'd hear it double. But that's how you know that you can hear your own game chat. Um, you won't hear yourself, obviously, in the recordings or in the streams that you're doing, but you'll hear other people just fine. You'll hear yourself. Uh, the stream can you know, kind of kind of vibe with you with listening to what's going on in game chat as well. So you're not, you know, quote unquote, talking to yourself. Um, but if you want to do something just for basic streaming to where people can hear you on Xbox, um, you guys don't have to change any of those settings. Um, the only setting you have to change is just make this to headset and speakers. And then streaming is just fine. If you have capture card, they can hear your party chat. So this is how you do game chat is all the first step. And then party chat is literally just having headset and speakers on and they can hear you just fine. And they can hear your party as well. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, guys. We're trying to hit 6K by the end of the year. And it'd be a great thing to hit. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Peace.